Hello everybody, and welcome back to my Let's Play. Um, I am Frostcrest, still, and today, uh, I think, since this, this uh, city isn't having too much problems, um, I'm going to expand into the second one, the one that connects by rail here, so we can start getting to a little bit of region play. But first, I want to show you guys the streetcars that we made last episode, because they're pretty cool. It gets a little blurry. I'm sorry, I don't really know how to fix that, but we're just going to go on low speed uh, for now. Come on, unpause. Um, and I noticed that the more you zoom in, the blurrier it gets, which makes sense. Also, the louder it gets. But, uh, uh wait, what's going to happen when it... Does it turn around here? Oh, well, that didn't make much sense. But yeah, these are the, the streetcars. Um, they're pretty nifty to watch them go along. I think I only have three right now. But, um... They travel the entire length of this, and they are little, they're butt to butt right now, so I don't know how useful that is. Perhaps when I add more intersections uh, and whatnot, instead of just making it this little curvature, um, it'll be actually a little more, uh, I don't want to say profitable for traffic, but it'll uh, ease up the pain a little bit for my, uh, my poor commuters. But yeah, these run the, uh, they're going to run the entire periphery. I only made half right at the beginning because I, I didn't want to make too much money or spend too much money and then they run down here um, and one thing I want to do before I leave this I want to pay off my bonds because I decided to leave it running a little bit before this episode just so I'd have enough money to uh, oh well just pretend you didn't didn't see that and these uh, these medium and uh, medium wealth people have been have been moving in and upgrading their houses in density and whatnot, but uh, traffic problem. You know what? That's fine enough for now. I'm gonna go claim this city over here. And I was thinking of doing a theme for this region because it is Viridian Woods. I might eventually start making some uh, some Pokemon theme names. Maybe Viridian City, uh, Cerulean City, whatnot. Um, I was thinking something maybe show themed. Right now it's it was gonna be butt themed. But eh, but um but I'm not sure if that's the way to go. Anywho, let's let's claim this place. It has some oil, which is nice. I haven't done anything with oil yet. Um let's see if the servers will let me claim this city though, because people have been saying that they've had a lot of problems with that. Um server problems still not resolved it seems. Um but yeah, in terms of theming, I don't know if you guys want me to do a theme or if I should just go with what I'm doing on my own. But Pokemon theme jumped in my head just because it would be cool to see if we could actually lay out some towns like uh, the original Pokemon um, or any of the other gens. Um, I, I watch a lot of fandom-related TV shows. I was thinking, I don't know, maybe give each fandom its own little town. Um, a Doctor Who tech town would be nice, and it would be a supernatural themed crime fighting. I don't know. Maybe give me some suggestions. We'll see. Um, let's pause this and pause. And since we have a Department of Finance in the region already, I think we can take out... Oh, well, we need to connect to the region first. Yeah. Um, also, we do have a lot less... Well, I guess not actually a lot less space, but um, a lot more water. Let's put it nicely that way. <laughs> work with. Um, I think I like I should follow the contour of the land though. That's our train station, so that's where a lot of our commuters are going to be coming in. Or out, depending on how this city ends up being, so I'm probably going to... I'm definitely going to make a big road there. So, let's make a medium density avenue. Okay, I'm going to try and be brave and use the <laughs> freeform tool. Actually, I should wait and maybe go up to here because I don't know exactly where the placement of the train station is. But I'm still going to try and be brave and use the curvy tool. Okay. Oh god, I'm a really bad drawer artist person. So... Okay, this is absolutely horrible. Maybe this isn't the tool that I thought it was. Oh my lord. Okay, I'm gonna undo that. 
because that was laughable. And I know that my my highly artistic girlfriend is going to be watching these and laughing really hard when she sees that attempt. So I'm gonna do this. Okay. Okay. Welcome to my town. <laughs> have a have a road that had a seizure. Mother. Okay. No, no, no. I need you to go. Sh oh, yeah. There's. If you hit shift, then it'll go straight here. Okay. Okay. That's good for now. Maybe to right here. Okay. Oh, I'm proud of that. This, this, not so much, but in general, I am proud of that. If you knew me, then you'd, you'd be proud too. Okay. So now that I'm connected to the, the region, I think that I can take out Big Daddy Bond. Yeah, I can take out three of you. And start in on paying that back. Oh, oops. I wasn't thinking. This is going to immediately... Crap. Okay. This is going to immediately eat into what starting money I have. I, that was not a smart decision. Kids, don't, don't do that at home. Um, so then we're immediately going to go... Well, residential, of course. But... Yeah, this this dark this dark yellow is the regional demand for factories overall. So this plus the other city. And the other city really needed some industrial. I think I said residential, but I meant industrial. Um and I need electricity and there's oil here, isn't there? So where's the wind blowing? No. Wind is blowing Oh, that means anything here is going to hit the rest of the region. You know what? I'm fine with that right now. But I do need to make it far away. But I also don't want to... Oh my gosh. This is a great... This is a great land. I don't want to mar it with this ugly thing. I could buy it from my other city. You know what? Because we're going in a region view, I'm going to buy this from that other city. I'm going to buy this from Buttopolis. Um, I'm not actually sure how much it has available right now, so it may get cut off. But yeah, this is region view, and you select um, the various utilities to buy them from the other neighboring cities in the region. Um, it seems that they do, like, if uh, if that city starts getting pressed for the things you're buying from them, they will stop. It'll notify you of that, but it's pretty much like, it doesn't say, you're going to stop soon. It says, it has stopped. So then you kind of have this moment of panic, like, oh crap, I need to suddenly fix all the things that are wrong in my city by blah, 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 blah. So that's a little bit, um, you don't want to rely too much on other cities if you haven't played them in a while, because you never know, um, you know, how much you're actually taking from them and how much they have uh, to give you. So yeah, let's get back to, let's go one way, or two way streets right now, because um, hmm, this is a very nice uh, cliff edge thing. That was a terrible way to express myself. Um, maybe we could put... Oh, no, we need to look at oil first, because I do want to use the oil in this place. Um, oh, crap, I forgot to start my timer. I've been... My, my episodes have been getting longer and longer. Um, so I'm going to start putting a timer on them, just so I know about where I am in each episode. Holy crackers. Okay, this land is so beautiful, but I'm kind of going to wreck it because I need the oil. Ugh, I feel like such a bad person. Okay, so since this is going to be an oil town, essentially, um, there's probably going to be a lot of... Oh, I'm still using the gross tool, aren't I? Um, there's probably going to be a lot of traffic, just because there's always a lot of traffic. Um, but, you know what, I'm going to go with this two-lane road right now, just because if I don't like a later, I can suck it up. That looks so ugly. You know what, I'm going to suck it up, and I'm going to use this, this, uh, 
artist tool. <laughs> yeah, nope. Confident that this doesn't look too terrible. No, get off of there. I don't want you there. I don't want you seeing that boy. No, nope, come out. Oh my god. Whatever. Whatever, whatever. Oh, <laughs> okay, okay, okay. See, as I said, I, uh, not very much artistic talent. I can, I can kind of sing and I can, I can dance if I need to. But if if you ever rely on me to draw, then I'm sorry. Let's let's take a look at our masterpiece. Oh, that is a that is a beautiful piece of work right there. And wow, what a piece of work it is. Yowzers. Okay, let's get some people in here. <laughs> um, get some shops. Da 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 da. All right. Um, since our oils, well, that's way too many shops. What was I thinking? I'm gonna throw some industry around here just for now. I don't put your industry this close to your housing, kids. Also, if you this took me a bit to figure out because like this this right here you you're not going to be able to put any any zoning but um you see these little shadows i don't know if you disable shadows in in your textures if it'll be there or not but that's where you can place things so if you're ever in kind of a sticky situation and you need to know there you go um i'm going to unzone this and zone more industrial again don't make a habit of doing that but I just, I need some money, because, as you can see, I'm 1,884 in the red. Plop down a house. This is, oh, this is going to be a disgusting looking town. I'm going to call it right now. But, I want to overlook the ocean of my disgusting little town. Hard work is paid off. Again, let me know what I should name this thing. Did my timer start? Oh no, did it stop again? Oh, I think it did. You know what? I'm just gonna play it by ear. Alright, so zoning. Uh, they don't want this much residential, so they're not gonna get it. Sorry, guys. You're gonna get more industrial. Because... That's why because all right okay and so what I'm eventually going to do with this is I'm going to get to petroleum export um, and I looked up because uh, as I said I kind of wanted to go the processing route and I think what I said in my first video is that you need to first do education to get your tech up to that level what I didn't realize is that you also have to have pretty much every other specialization down so like you have to it's a culmination of metals and plastic and education, essentially, that uh, gets processors going. Because you need to you need the refined oil to make the plastics. You need the metal HQ to make the alloys and the metal. And then you need the education for the people to, for the businesses to arise that use the processors. So we have to go with the basic stuff first, of course. Which I just, that was just me not doing my research. Um, so yeah, that's what we're going to get going here. And I think, I think, I think, I think we can do this from the start. Or not. I need seven industrial buildings. Okay, that's fair. And as you can see, our deficit is getting smaller and smaller each time. Um, but whenever we do get our first upgrade, I'm going to use the transport upgrade so that we can plop down a train. And I'm not sure, because I have literally have not done any research on this high-speed trade, but I think we can plop it 
on a regular train line. And I don't know if it's just um, if it's just for looks or if it's functionally different. Uh, it says it brings low and medium wealth tourists as well as commuters and shoppers, and this one brings low and medium wealth tourists and commercial and shoppers. So it might just be for looks, but I guess we'll find out um, whenever we, yeah. But it looks like our oil well was approved. So we want to plop it. I'm not sure how the pollution for this is. So I think I'm going to plop it right in the middle there. Okie dokie. Well, I guess we can see if there's any pollution on there. Um, it doesn't, doesn't really say. So we're going to draw a little road. Because um, there shouldn't be too much traffic going to it. I'm going to make a medium one for now. And uh, I'll just do a straight one. Get rid of this curvy stuff. I think this is about the center of it. God, that looks so... The hills... Cramping my style, man. <laughs> what is that? What is that? Uh, oh, I just, guess it just didn't render. <laughs> okay. Oh, wrong button. Sorry, guys. One at this one. Okay, oil. Plop my oil down there. That seems like a lot of barrels. Okay. And I'm actually going to choose the guide me for this. Because I, as I said, I don't know what to... Oh, no. Suck it up. Suck it up, suck it up, suck it up. And then I think I need to buy a trade depot for it to send it uh, to places. But I'm going to wait for the guide me first for him to tell me what to do. Alright. Um, zoning. Looks like they want more stuff. Commercial needs... Oh, nope, we're going to start on my guide me. We can title this... Okay, we need a trade depot. Okay, so I do need a trade depot. I was indeed correct. Alright. Oh, wait, nope, get back here. Okay, so we'll place this down. We'll be right here. Okay, what's our next step? God, I wish they wouldn't, they would let me see the other steps after I complete one. Okay, add a crude oil storage lot, and then start selling it on the global market. Alright. So the way that these trade depots work, if you haven't done it already, is you can add up to three uh, modules. The first one that comes by default is freight, and this actually confused me really, like this really confused me in the beginning. Um, when industrial would say, we don't have places to ship our freight. That's because you need a place like this to send your freight to. So they ship it to here, and then they sh this trade depot ships it on the global market. So if that's what they're complaining about, add one of these things, you'll be good to go. You'll start making a lot more money, too. Um, anywho, crude oil storage lot. Plop. That'll, yeah, complete that. And um, there are more than, you can only plop three modules plus the one it comes with and there's as you can see a lot more so you'll have to if for whatever reason you have a city that wants to import or export all of these things you will have to have more than one trade depot and you can import and export both things so if you go to gl uh, manage global market deliveries right here then you can say you use stuff locally, import it if uh, you're into the manufacturing but not the production or sorry the manufacturing but not the uh, extraction of oil or ore or coal, you'll import it or export it if you have more than you can use. And we will be exporting this right now. Um, yeah. Doo -doo -doo. I'll probably connect those. Yeah, I'm going to connect those two as well. Um, I guess I'll do it now since they're, um, they're still hiring. I guess I'll make this curved since... Oh, I didn't want to crush him, but... Oh, well. See, that's a proper curve. <laughs> All these guidelines. Oh, terrifying. Just truly terrifying. Okay. Zone residential. Yep, I know. 
It's not going to be happy residential, because there's a lot of industrial. There's still a good amount of industrial demand. I don't know why they're not zoning here. Or not zoning, but, you know, picking up the zones there. I'm going to get rid of this, because it looks like people don't. Oh yeah, I just got just rezone the screen. Um, there we go. Did I place? Yes, I placed down my house already. Or not my house, but my town hall. All right, what's the problem, good sir? Petroleum facilities closed. They're now hiring. Mass transit neighboring cities. Does this not go to my other city? Let's see. This should go to. Okay, I guess for whatever reason I don't have people coming in from that city, or maybe it's just not registering it uh, yet. Okay, see, now it is working. And um, I think the last thing here is, yeah, we need to earn six, 60000 from crude oil on the uh, global market sales. Um, I think that since I don't have a city who buys oil, I won't get any money from it. I'm not sure if it if it will like spoof a third city there just to to say hey you're selling stuff or if it won't I guess we'll find that out um, I think I'm just gonna s wait and see because this will eventually fill up um, and I'm gonna wait for it to fill up and then maybe wait a few in-game days um, and if nothing sells then we'll know and if that's the case then I'll either set up a oil factory and uh, an oil factory and oil um, an oil power plant in a third city, or I will make one in my other city, even though I said I'd go clean, um, just because I really want to get region region view working. Um, and hey, we're in the we're in the green right now, so that's good. We've got our little city here, and I think even though my timer didn't start perfectly on time, we're running close to out of time. So I'm gonna I'm gonna call it a day right now. And tomorrow we'll work on either, I think I'm going to work on cleaning up this city to make it look a little more <laughs> pleasing, because this is just unacceptable. Alright, thanks for joining me guys. I'll see you later. Bye bye